Hi there, Adam Bazalgette here, founder of Scratch Golf Academy. Today's subject, putting distance control, give you feels, keys, and drills. We'll look at two principles you have to know. We'll show you drills for both indoor and outdoor practice. Well, briefly, if you've seen my videos before but haven't subscribed, I'd really appreciate it if you do that. Also, hit the little red bell there. We'll get you notified every time a new video is coming your way. Okay, well, two principles you need to know when you're talking about distance control with putting. Number one, it's a misnomer to think of accelerating through the putt. You want a pendulum. Now certainly a pendulum does accelerate. There is a natural buildup of speed, but it reaches top speed right here at the bottom, then starts to decelerate immediately. That's what you want for putting. It's much more natural than all this hitting, and the beauty of it is you'll hit the putt at top speed of the club, but at most stability. In other words, the club's neither decelerating nor accelerating at that point. Second principle you need to know, once you've picked out a cadence or a rhythm that's good for you, let's say tick, talk. You want that same rhythm for every putt, whether it's short or long. So a short stroke would be, let's say, tick, tock, long one, tick, tock. Obviously, we'll talk about that. The speed of the stroke is going to change, but the rhythm would stay the same. Now, let's look at a little piece of equipment. It's free to you. It'll really help you with this practice. Then we'll get to our outdoor and our indoor drill. Well, it's the free Scratch Golf Academy app. We have Putting Tempo Trainer we're about to use, Swing Tempo Trainer, Green Reading Trainer, warm-up videos, all sorts of things that you'll get a lot of benefit out of. Just go to the App Store. We'll select Putting Tempo Trainer. Now, when you first get it, when you first bring it up, I should say, you'll get a video from me teaching you which selection would be best for you, how to make the best selection of tempo. We're going to skip that. I'll take Medium. That's the one I use. And when I hit Start, the button button will pulsate and you'll hear a metronome type beat. That's take away to contact. That's what that times. Take away contact. Now, if you want no noise, just turn your volume down on your phone there. Lay this down by your golf ball on the green without bothering anyone. You can go off the beeps and work on your tempo that way. Let's look at the drill. Okay, first our outdoor drill here, and I'd recommend they use the app there. I'm not going to use it on this drill here, just so the sound's a little clearer. I'll use it on the indoor one. Instead of always just putting to the hole, here's what I recommend. Line three balls up. The goal is to putt three balls the same length. Now, the first ball becomes effectively the target ball. Can you repeat that? If you can, you're well on your way to consistent rhythm. So let's try a putt here. Again, there's no target other than a sense of the distance I had. This green's pretty quick too, so it's challenging. Hit that a little bit harder, I could tell. Just could tell there was a little bit off with the rhythm. And you see the difference. Let's try again for the original ball. That's pretty reasonable rhythm there. And in the next set, I might make it quite a bit shorter on the following set, quite a bit longer. But if you can get that feel, notice I didn't take too much time between putts. Get in that rhythm. You get those sort of results where it's consistent, you know you're making progress. Okay, for the indoor version, towel rolled up in the corner, that will stop the golf balls, could be a pillow or a cushion or something. And I'm gonna hit some putts here, and I'm gonna use my app. We'll start it up, I'm on that medium setting. Again, one beat is takeaway, the next beat is contact, and I'll just hit putts of different sizes against that cushion or towel. Let's try a little softer putt here. And I can really start to map that in, get that where it's automatic, whatever size stroke I make, invaluable a few minutes of this regularly when you're away from the course. Well, I hope that helps you with putting for distance control, feel and drills. Work on these things, they'll help you. Would appreciate a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video.